We start our discussion of drugs with the concept of organic chemistry, which is a study of carbon compounds. Organic compounds are made up of carbon and only a few other elements. Chief among the other elements are hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. Also present are the elements of sulfur, phosphorus, and the halogens. Halogens are fluorine, chlorine, bromine, or iodine. Chemists have discovered or made over 10 million organic compounds, and an estimated 10,000 new ones are discovered or made each year. By comparison, chemists have discovered or made only an estimated 1.5 million inorganic compounds. Thus, approximately 85% of all known compounds are organic. Carbohydrates, lipids, proteins, enzymes, nucleic acids, hormones, vitamins, and almost all other biochemicals are organic. We'll use aspirin to illustrate what we mean by functional groups and organic chemistry. Aspirin is made from a natural product, salicylic acid, and modified to reduce side effects, especially stomach irritation. Most drugs have side effects because they interact with tissues other than the target tissue. We can be fairly sure that aspirin would be approved today because so much research has been done to document the frequency of any side effects and its enormous benefits. However, if it were a newly discovered compound, it would take longer to get to market today than it did in the late 1800s. What is a functional group? A functional group is an atom or group of atoms within a molecule that shows a characteristic set of predictive physical and chemical properties. This table summarizes the major functional groups of carbon molecules. Functional groups are important because they undergo the same types of chemical reactions no matter in which molecules they are found. To a large measure, they determine the chemical and physical properties of the molecule. They are the units by which we divide organic compounds into families. They also provide the basis on which we derive names for organic compounds. For example, the ester functional group is of major importance to aspirin's biological activity. It is removed by the body later when the drug is metabolized and then excreted. Because water is a polar solvent, positive and negative charges on molecules improve their solubility. This property helps biochemists direct the molecule to its target. Hormonal systems are key to the integration of body function. Drugs often function by enhancing or inhibiting hormone activity. Drugs may be broadly classified as, first, those that cause a physiological process in the body, such as aspirin, anti-cancer drugs, or morphine, and second, those that kill foreign invading organisms, such as antibiotics or antifungal agents. Like drugs, endocrine disruptors may inhibit or enhance hormonal activity. As adults, we are fairly resilient to the short-term effects of acute exposure to endocrine disruptors. However, during development, organisms are very vulnerable to interference that can cause birth defects or other problems that may not become apparent until later in life. 